called? If you're not in the Discord, fuck with the Discord because I be in there the most, honestly. And we do like community showcases and like neighborhood radio and shit like that. So, you know what I'm saying? They're actually doing neighborhood radio right now. We could pop in there. I'm curious actually what's going on in here. I'm gonna I'm gonna I'm gonna pop in for a quick second. Oh, they're doing a tier list for comic book movies. I mean there aren't any of the shows. They got Superman and the Dark Knight at S tier. Oh wow, this is hilarious. No, no Spider Verse guys. Come on. I'm, I'm just, I'm just talking shit in here, but not on the actual. <laughs> this is hilarious. Spider-Verse would always be an F. I mean. Hold on one sec. I've been in here thumping, thumping. Give me one sec, y'all. Oh, you're in, yeah. you're on stream. Okay, hold up. Um, if you're on stream, get up, Rick. Get up the Marvel movie MC. Get up the Marvel movie tier list. Get up the Marvel movie tier list. I'm about to hold on one sec. This is our Marvel tier list. We haven't seen a lot of the yeah. shows, and that's every. So and it, it, it posted each season separately, so uh, that's why that is all that stuff. But this, this is what we got. I know it might be a little bit controversial. Hold on one hey, sec. Let me um let me pull this up so that everybody on the <laughs> stream can see it. <laughs> You're assessing it right now. Hold on one sec. I'm about to get this on on in on the stream so that folks can check it out. Cause this is about to be funny as fuck. Yeah. So we we spent we spent probably 30 40 minutes making this. I think. Ah, really? Uh, so yeah, it's uh. It's proven to be a bit controversial already with uh, some of the viewers. <laughs> of course. I mean, me, me, I mean, some of our opinions are so widely different. We you have know, to compromise in the middle. But, and, but to be honest, like, we've agreed a lot more than for the I majority, thought yeah, for, for the majority, me and uh, Zeke have actually been fighting against the chat. <laughs> yeah. Is it the majority of you and Zeke have been fighting the chat? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> That's hilarious. Yeah, like, uh, we both put Black Panther in B tier, and that was not, oh, wow. that was not a pop. That was not a popular. <laughs> yeah, we can, we can I can show see that. again. But like, the, the, what the, else? That final what fight, else? Bro. <laughs> yeah, what else is controversial? Uh, yeah, Guardians of the Galaxy placings. Yeah, you want to? Uh, How do I get this on full screen? Is there a way for me to make this full screen? Uh, I actually don't. You, I think if you click the three dots, no. Rick, can you can, can, maybe you I'm can trying. maybe save it? Oh. Maybe drop the PNG in chat and screen. Screen. we can. Like save it as an exit out of the chat. Oh, yeah, you can, you can I think that this is a little bit better. Is this better, y'all? If when you click, the sorry, image, I'm asking chat if they can see it on on the stream. When you click the image, there's uh, open in browser scene. In ah, wait, that. now it's a little bit. Yeah, it's bigger now. Okay, yeah, this is better. Yeah. What what tier did you guys put Wakanda forever in? Or you haven't done it yet? Uh, wait, oh, yeah, we, we haven't seen it. Not, we haven't seen it. Ah, uh, okay. Heard, I'll be honest, I haven't heard great things about it. I just watched all of the, the whole Crazy. Infinity okay. Okay, so Thunder, Nick said he just watched that. the whole Infinity Universe. So, wait, yeah. what, were you, what were you about to say, though? Love and Thunder is in B tier. I wanted to push back on it, but Zeke felt so strongly about it. <laughs> the end of that movie. The end of that movie. I love the end of that movie. 
<laughs> yeah, I mean, he just said that, like, it's a, it, it could have been the most ass movie, like, in every regard ever. But if that last scene was still the same how it's supposed to be, then he, he'll still put it in B. Like, from from the moment that they're in the, um, in the black and white planet onwards, like, it was amazing. I think I agree with him about the Thor. Okay. <laughs> yeah. This is very, this is a very interesting tier list. This is fun. Yeah. Hey, we, um... Yeah. Like like Ant Man being being in B, he wanted it in in D and C. I I, wow. I like Ant Man movies though. I do too. Yeah. What's your What's your favorite MC, MCU movie, Dom? What, my what favorite favorites? My favorite MCU movie. Um. Hmm. I would. I mean, are we like? I'm not gonna put like any of the Avengers movies in there if that makes sense. Because I feel like that's not necessarily yep. like fair. <clears throat> um. Hmm. What would my favorite be? I would like say that my fa like my personal favorites would be like the first Black Panther, the first Doctor Strange. Um. I really like. <laughs> I really think that like I I I know that like a lot of people don't like Iron Man two and Iron Man three, but I think that they're really hey. good movies. We put, we put we put Iron Man. We put Iron, Let's go. We put, where did we put Iron Man three? Oh, see, I, I wanted to put that in. I want I wanted to put that in B tier. I think, but I, I think I think three. <laughs> Nick is shaking game. his head. Strong. He said Iron Man three is straight F. <laughs> three three. Straight F. That's hilarious. <laughs> I think I think Iron Man three just kind of stinks a little bit in retrospect. That like you know, I'm not a yeah. yeah you know, honestly, that. for me, I'm not a big fan of the Thor series at all. Um, oh no, you don't yeah. personally. Yeah, I'm not a big fan of them. Um, the only thing that I'm a fan of in the Thor universe is the Valkyrie scenes. Yeah. Everything yeah, no. else. She's a, she's, a, she's a pretty cool character. Everything else is um, like everything else is pretty mid to me. Honestly, like the yeah, story, I'm not attached I, I, to I, it. Um, if I there's a, the I, and also too, like I think that like if I'm if I'm trying to put my biases aside, I think the best series of all the series in Marvel is definitely Guardians of the Galaxy. Oh, I, I I think like like in terms of like just like as like a, its own like series of movies, a hundred percent. Yeah, like, like if it wasn't associated with game. the MCU at all, it would still be good. Yeah, a hundred percent. I didn't mean to come in I here and just like completely commandeer or... neighborhood radio. By the way, nah, you're good. Like like, but like you know, I, I I'm kind of you know we 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 needed to talk a little bit more about the the movies because it was just me and Zeke mostly agreeing. <laughs> yeah, but like. Yeah, I mean, I think, like, I wanted Thor to be with the Guardians of the Galaxy for the third one, but it was still, like, a good movie. Um, do I prefer Infinity War or Endgame? I would say Infinity War, personally. There we go, let's go. Yeah. Like, inf like I'm, if we're talking about Marvel movies, like, the like that has, like, the most iconic Marvel moments, Infinity like... Infinity War is the first one, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. Who's yeah. there with you? Oh, um, my homie Nick. Oh, what's good, Nick? What, yeah, what's yeah. Favorite? He's the one that I did on um, the the track on on Bomber Cyberpunk with, actually. Oh, hell yeah, great track. Oh. Thank you. What What's his favorite? What's up? From the MCU, what's his favorite? What? Yeah. yeah. Oh, what's your favorite? What's Nick? I think I'm gonna have to go with Ragnarok. Either that I think or that's favorite. Favorite. I, I think that's a I, pretty strong I, 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 I was gonna say I think that's very respectable. Ragnarok is heaps of fun. I I, I just really, really have to it. like watch the other Thor movies for it. Mm. Don't you so generally good point. get what's going on? And Love and Thunder is like a close second, but I think Ragnarok finally on that one. <laughs> another Love and Thunder appreciate. I'm so happy. I'm so happy that there's another <laughs> Love and Thunder appreciate it. Like I was that getting such a bad rap. I was getting dog piled for saying that that movie was, no, wasn't cool. bad. I thought yeah. it was awesome. I actually, just I, watched I, it. what I like the most about it is that I think that that and Guardians of the Galaxy take the they they take the MCU the least serious out of all of the MCU yeah. films, which is like fun, mm. and I love how fun that is. But I'm not a f I'm personally think that Love and Thunder is like a little bit too silly. No, I agree. I no, agree. I, 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 will, I also agree with that. Like it's like, it, like I feel like Love and Thunder is like jumping the shark. Yeah, I, I can, I can, I, I, It's like for me, Love and Thunder is like two different movies, like in one movie. Um, like the scene, the scene in Love and Thunder where they're trapped on that black and white planet by Christian Bale's character, like mm. that's one of the most terif terrifying, like insane 
scenes in a Marvel movie for me. Oh, he played um, an amazing villain, by the way. Yeah, Christian Bale was incredible. Probably like one of my favorite MCU villains. Agreed. But um, how do, you, how do y'all feel about Spider Man? How do you feel about what? Spider Man. Spider Man. Um, I personally think that, and I, oh my gosh, I probably shouldn't be saying this on stream. (laughs) (laughs) Um, I think that like Homecoming, No Way Home, those are definitely my least favorite Spider-Man movies of like all time. Yeah. Yes. Finally. So we put, we put, we put Homecoming in C tier. Um, I, yeah, that's, I think that's like, I, I respect I respect it being in C tier. You know what I'm saying? I yeah. think that any higher or any lower would be like biased. But yeah. that is like solid to me. You know? Um Yeah. Uh, it's it's yeah. a it's a it's fine. Like it is it is fine. It um Which Spooderman is the best in my POV? I would say that it would be I, I mean Spider Verse is like twelve out of ten. Yeah. Like the very first Across, one. Uh, yeah. Yeah. It's, it's, like it's, it's the f- I, I think all other movies now. Everybody's, yeah, I feel like the thing about Spider Verse that's so sick is the first watch. Like, everybody's first watch of Spider Verse, like, completely just obliterates. I was gonna say, the the first, so I watched Into the Spider Verse opening weekend. I was working at a movie theater at the time, right? And Sony Sony Pictures Animation, their last film before that was the Emoji Movie. So, when Emoji Movie, so so when I go into Into the Spider Verse, I'm like, man, this is probably gonna be shit. Um, but you know, it was free, so I guess I'll go watch it. Um, and then it ended up just blowing my mind. Yeah, she was good as fuck. Animations, like, I, I was saying, okay, so like, I was, I watched Jack's films, and back then, like, the Emoji movie was a meme, so I saw that movie with my friends. That movie sucked, but the actual yeah. animation quality was superb, because it's a super big studio. Hmm. So when I, when it was announced that they were doing Spider-Verse and doing all this experimental animation and stuff, I just knew it was going to be. I, I remember yeah. crying so much that first movie. I had absolutely zero expectations for... That's kind of Spider-verse. Cool. And really it, it, I hope that they. Ha- I hope what I think would be really sick for them to do is I would love to see like a separate Marvel Cinematic Universe that's just for animated shit, mm-hmm. and then like yeah. one like like I feel like they can like get re- like between Spider Verse, What If, and like a couple of other franchises that they have that mm-hmm. like can be very easily adapted into like animated forms. I feel like. It'd be really dope to have like an animated MCU and a regular MCU. You know what I'm saying? Uh huh. Yeah. I mean, I think it, like the animation just kind of makes it easier to do comic booky shit. Mm-hmm. Says so somebody wants to hop on the mic. Uh, I don't know who that person is. This person just joined. They. Yeah, oh, this is Peak. That's Pico from BRC. I was gonna say. Some guys oh. getting so mad about the takes. He's like, I gotta come in. No, 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 you're Gucci. <laughs> you Yo. <laughs> Yo, what's cracking, my guy? What's up, dudes? What's cracking, brother? Yeah, I was, uh. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Let me get you, like, rolls and shit like that, real quick. Hold on one sec. Yeah, yeah, bet. Are you the one that did the, the tag with the girl? Yeah, yeah. So I did three tags, and then I did the voice of Trice, DJ Cyber, oh. and the Franks. Yo, I unlocked DJ Cyber yesterday. I've been playing as him. Like, yeah, that shit is that's so fucking enjoying? sick, dog. Yeah, it's um the 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 one with the the tag with the girl. Like, uh, I dropped that shit everywhere on Pyramid uh, on Pyramid. Hell Islands. yeah! <laughs> it's dropping on console uh, on the first, right? Yeah, 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 on the first. Yeah, when when I was making um those tags, because I knew that a lot of people would use like really like thin lines and stuff for like their graffiti. But I wanted it to like stand out, and I was super into like like I'm still into like the gradients and things like that. So that was like my, my mentality going into it. Yeah, I just wanted to be like really appealing. You can like see it from like across like the game. Yeah. Hell yeah. But yeah, I agree, Dom. I agree with your take when it comes to like animations, because like like I draw and stuff. Like I went to school for like animation. I dropped out that bitch, but like like I know things but like i agree so much recently i watched um i forget what what it was called but I, oh yeah yeah batman beyond i don't know if y'all have seen that oh yeah but that's a classic I yeah batman love... beyond is uh, batman beyond is amazing i remember it's growing up like... watching that shit that was so fucking sick <laughs> mm-hmm. yeah like bro i 
I watched it recently like, because I've never like watched it like fully and shit. And I watched it recently. I'm like, yo, the setting is sick. The music is sick. Like, I would fight 10 fully grown men just for Batman Beyond to have like the Spider Verse treatment. That would be sick. <laughs> That feel you so on that, I, yeah. I remember, seeing, I remember seeing, people, seeing people say that they want a Batman, Batman version. Yeah, mm -hmm. like that would be that would be dope. That'd like, be super hard. They yeah, definitely need. They definitely need like just a section for like because I feel like now everyone's like okay, like we take animation like a little bit more seriously now, and that's so mm -hmm. like it's so sick seeing like my friends that were like never like really like on that when it came to like the stuff we do, but then like. Spider Verse kind of like like breaking like that boundary in a way where like like I haven't I would not have like seen the movie yet but my friends are already like in the fucking theater and shit and you don't necessarily like do art or anything and that's so mm -hmm. sick to see like everyone like supporting it so it's like yo mm -hmm. the proof is right there like give us like the money and like the stuff to like do more Facts. with that and, like have more, yeah more fun. I mean like like DC like has like, actually a good like. Uh, catalog of animated movies. They, they have yeah. a yeah. lot of really good theater. animated when? movies. They're just they go like straight to DVD. They're not yeah, like and streaming. And then yeah, they're not treated the same way as like they're not treated like full motion pictures and shit like that. You know what I'm saying? What, yeah, yeah. When I was in um, I was sick in 2021. Um, and I watched about 20 or 30 of the DC animated movies. Hey, thank you so much, um, Tim. Appreciate you. In that whole week, and they're so fucking solid. <laughs> yeah. Uh, like. The Dark Knight Returns, part one and part two. Like, that shit is a monster. Yo, the, I would God, say that's the... I, you know what the best DC animated movie is? Fucking The Killing mm -hmm. Joke. That shit is crazy. I was about to say Killing Joke. I, I remember that one. That shit is I haven't, nuts. I haven't, seen, I haven't seen The Killing Joke Dog, yet, but I know the comic's joke amazing. Is I read crazy. I read the comic in high school, and it's an awesome comic. I, but, I, was um, saying, I, prefer, I, I definitely prefer the comic, but the, the, the hmm. movie's still pretty good. Yeah, the comic is definitely better, but the movie is still just like, wow, like, y'all y'all did that shit. Ending's dope. Yeah. I really like yeah. that. Yeah. Cause Under the Red Hood. A lot of, like, animated movies, but, like, I'd be finding out about them, like, like a year later or mm -hmm. something. Like, I never see it, like, really, yeah. like... That, I, I, like they need to... Anything. They need to gain confidence and give one a full theatrical release, like across the Spider Verse. Honestly. True. Yeah, that's you all. This really, really good. You like, should, like, like the and stuff. also, that, Pico. Um, I just want to the... say it's mad funny hearing you say "yo" because, like, I've heard you say "yo" so much over the last <laughs> like, week. If that for real, makes sense. yeah, <laughs> uh, for real, for real. <laughs> uh, that's just me. Yeah. <laughs> I, I just um, had to add to point that out. The, they did the um, they did an adaptation of the Death of Superman arc um, in an animated movie like a year or two ago. Oh um, yeah, I haven't that, seen that. That shit is honestly like I rated them both five stars, like the Death of Superman and the Return of Superman. Like True. they were yeah, amazing. For it. And there was also a really good one um, that's on Netflix, um, the Superman Red Sun, which is uh, if Superman fell fell into communist Russia um, instead oh, yeah, of America. I yeah, I've heard yeah. about that one. <laughs> yeah, it's it's really it's really good, and there's like and there's there's communist Batman, uh, like it's crazy. Crazy. That's nuts. Have, that's fucking don't, nuts. Don't they have the big like the, the like that symbol on their chest or some shit? Like, yeah, yeah, yeah. He has Wild, the he has the the, the, the hammer and sickle on his chest. His, yeah, yeah. <laughs> fucking crazy. Yeah. And um, oh sorry, Batman's not a communist. Batman's like a revolutionary. Um, and he like fights that's Superman. That's so um, funny. To like try that and like, stop communism or some shit. <laughs> no, I can't fully remember, but um, That's it's worth a watch. Comic book. I like yeah, that. it's like oh like like I was, that kind of shit is what I was hoping that What If would be with Marvel. Feel that. What, uh, what if again? Half of it was really interesting. The other half was like, all right. Yeah. Definitely. Feel the Zombie that. Avengers. The Zombie Avengers shit was kind. Of, was kind of cool. I like, I like seeing the I like seeing the world. I like I low key like wanted just a series of that. Honestly, <laughs> mm. I got like I got pretty invested into it. Ooh, I have a question for y'all. Yeah, okay. yeah. If yeah of course. Y'all could like pick any like superhero to get like like um like the Spider Verse treatment. Like, what would you pick? Ooh, Ooh. wow. 
That's a great question. Do you mean it's in like the whole? Do you mean do you mean the whole the whole multiverse thing where there's like heaps of different versions of them and all that, or just the animation style? Just, I think just, just like, like the care. Picking a hero to have like yeah, yeah okay yeah. yeah yeah yeah. I, I think, think Flash Flash I is pretty good pick because that, that's one of the most mm. disrespected uh, superheroes in modern day. Espe like there's so much because there's there's so much to the Flash. Like it's not like Superman where you just need like the basic summary and you know who the superman is like the flash is like yeah. pretty like layered yeah. and i don't it, it doesn't yeah. get explain, explored enough and like the, the only representation is fucking ezra villier like that's like yeah <laughs> dude i dude i love fair fair, fair. Yeah, yeah yeah flash I is pretty love, bad right now i love fast characters I, I would love that the animation would go crazy too dude. you know what i would I, I, honestly you know what i would it really love to see like, i would love to see just yeah. wolverine get that yeah that would be sick that would Bro, like like because the the, be the reason why off. I feel like that would be hard is because like I feel like um with animation like I, I don't know like animated violence um like illustrated violence specifically like you can go really really over the top with certain shit the, that um, you just cannot do in real life and Wolverine's yeah. whole like shtick yeah. kind of is just I, I, like I, all that type of shit. You you know the you know with Wolverine you know the the animated section in Kill Bill. Yes. Like, that's what I would that, like a like Wolverine. Yes, yeah. absolutely. Uh -huh. fucking yeah. Have y'all seen uh, yeah. Wolverine versus Hulk? That animated. Uh... Someone said that they love the scene in the Flash where they put a baby. Where the Flash ran at Mox yeah, and put a baby in a microwave. In microwave. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I can't yeah, believe yeah, that shit happened. Tell me, was that was that like that scene floating around? Was that reversed or like what? What's going on with? So, no. so the context with no the context with that is that all of the babies um are falling out of a hospital and there's like all this electricity and all this energy um and because of the way that microwaves are built the microwave itself will absorb all the energy and not impact the baby um and so that's why he puts the baby in the microwave because it can like block out all the radiation or electricity i can't fully remember but whatever's happening in that scene it blocks the baby from being exposed to it um what? So. he put the babies yeah. in little <laughs> faraday cages bruh <laughs> <laughs> literally yeah 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 um like, block the microwaves with a microwave <laughs> <laughs> that's that's what that scene was supposed to be and um it's but yeah it, it was hilarious that movie is just crazy yeah that shit shit is, insane yeah that movie is nice. it was um it's Quite one crazy. of those movies like i'm a i'm a big fan of blockbuster movies that have ridiculous budgets that go absolutely nowhere and you're just like where what the fuck even is this like yeah, you have. I wish I was in that board game <laughs> for that movie, man. It, 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 none of it makes sense. Yeah, that shit yeah. Is <laughs> like shit, even yeah, that's a nice movie. Yeah, I had the Flashpoint like, Paradox like, animated movie. Word. That movie is. I haven't seen that. Movie that. is amazing. I haven't yeah. seen Flashpoint that. Paradox animated is crazy good. That true. What I um in Flashpoint Paradox um the animated movie um instead of Batman being Bruce Wayne still it's um it's an alternate universe where thomas wayne watched bruce and um his wife die um oh, wow. so he right. becomes batman and, and um and his wife goes oh sorry no his wife doesn't die sorry sorry so bruce is the one that dies and his mum becomes the joker and his dad becomes a man oh damn that's wild that's wild um, as fuck yeah, so his his mom goes insane from Bruce dying, and then all the dad, alternate yeah, storylines are so crazy. So. Yeah, that's what I love about that shit is like, yeah. Again, I feel like What If was a bit of a bit cowardly in terms of making that kind of insane shit. <laughs> uh, but yeah. Anyway, true, 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 true. I think true. I would choose uh, I would choose Blue Beetle to get that treatment. Ooh, Let's go, the scarab, scarabs. Nobody knows about yeah. scarabs, bro. Cause like, imagine like all the fights of him like transforming like mid fight, like just like they have so much fun Facts. in like his suit during like all of that and like yeah, playing these people don't that. even know he got different modes, bro. Valid. Cause, cause, cause like like cause like like the way that like in Spider Verse you see like Miles get used to like the powers and swinging around, you can mm -hmm. see like him get used to like scarab and like the sickest of ways. Like yeah, I always mm -hmm. love like. Blue Beetle's design, like as a kid and stuff. But yeah. yeah have you so seen real Blue, Blue Beetle? Beetle? Oh, I have not. I have not. I'm kind of scared. No, lie. everybody watch it. Everybody right now, everybody watching, listening, 
watch the Blue Beetle. Watch it ten Blue? times. Yeah, yeah you Blue gotta support. Blue Beetle Battalion. <laughs> oh, the gang I had fell asleep in the, the middle Blue of the stream. What's up? I'm here for no. this conversation. No. Yeah, the Blue Beetle. Run, runaways, runaways is F. Let's go ahead and put that there right now. <laughs> well, we, we've already made the tier list. We haven't seen it. Which one's in F? Did you say? Runaways. He, he wants runaways to go. <laughs> oh, I've never. Heard we haven't. Of we haven't. Def we haven't even. So heard many of, of these, I never heard of. Definite F. Eternals. Definite F. Uh, <laughs> Yo, got straight to the point. I'm yeah, bro. To the point. Yeah, wait, 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 wait. I Nigga didn't even ask what's going on, what we what's doing, or nothing on? like I that. Said, I just bro. said that. I said I just woke up, but I'm here bro, for a conversation. Bro. Bro. This bro, bro. Walking in the court, like, nah, he's guilty. Bro, the only reason why this nigga woke up is because Runaways being on the tier list disturbed his dream. He's like, oh, fuck with that shit. Nah, I gotta start shooting. I, I, as soon as I see ass, I gotta start shooting. You feel me, Paul? Like, Ridiculous. Uh, Have any of y'all seen that, that Widow, the uh, Black Widow? That's um, like the... My parents have watched it a bunch of times, and usually when my parents are like really into a movie, that's how I know it's terrible. The parent <laughs> meter, that's like the Why? moist meter. For like, real. no funny Why? shit. They've watched, they've watched like Black <laughs> Adam like 10 times this summer. <laughs> my, um, my mom has great taste in movies, but my dad, he's, he said that Cat in the Hat's better than Kill Bill. And I'm just wow. like, wow. Kind of so see, the thing Mike about Myers, it is, my parents don't have base. bad taste in movies. Like, they, they do have bad <laughs> taste in movies. They'll watch, like, they just watch, like, popcorn shit, if that makes sense. They don't necessarily mm -hmm. want to, like, yeah. watch stuff that they have to, like, think about mm -hmm. or, like, uh, care my, about my, the storyline and shit. Yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, that. shit. It's like water cooler dad, movies. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. yeah. My um, my dad, his his bread and butter for movies is anything with Ben Stiller and Owen Wilson. Like, <laughs> <laughs> That's actually a safe bet. That's a you safe give bet. him a movie Fair. with those actors, or and and his and his like yeah, cinematic masterpiece, best movie I've ever seen. Oh, my dad just loves all like, of like Adam Sandler type Fury. comedy, that stuff. My dad loves. That shit is hard. Blades of Fury was hilarious. But so, bro, I like I like I like so that cool. movie. Yeah. Classics. Have y'all seen Zohan? That's that's Zohan. that might be Adam Sandler's oh, best. Zohan goodness. is crazy. Oh my goodness. I've been saying Zohan. Yeah, Zohan you have, dude, you have to. I showed I had like six, seven of my friends who love Adam Sandler, but they haven't seen it. I showed them yeah, it. Zohan's quite unhinged. Was dying. That do, I, like, um... <laughs> I sort of want to back like... up. I want to back up my accusations from earlier if I can though. <laughs> I sort, of just, I sort of just pulled out the 4570 and started letting the lever action go. <laughs> yeah. Runaways is just boring. All right, in my I've in never my even heard of it. In my, this, see, on, that's I'll be right back. I'm going to go to the bathroom real quick, so I'm going to let Nick hop in the combo as well, too. He's over here with me right now. No worries. But I'm going to let you. Yeah. All right. But I'm not I'm not trying to override anybody's opinion with it. No, it's like, oh, this wait, wait. My, no. This hey, is man, my, the not seen is free reign. Yo, yeah, guys, anything, I've actually, anything, I remember the, I remember this comic. I remember this comic. What the? Anything. We, we the the action. Runaways comic actually like mid tier, kind of decent, but the the live action stuff, they just tried to do so much different stuff and cater to so many different audiences that it just turned into a pile of shit for real. Oh, and where, where, where it's, it's like, like inoffensive pirate. and stuff. Not even really trying to get with any agendas, but sort of trying to cater to every audience to sort of like hit everything across the board and it really just turned into an ass show rather than focusing on the characters that came with the show. You know what I'm saying? Uh, this, this, this doesn't look like a Marvel movie, bro. Also, <laughs> no, it, it, no. It, 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 I've never it, even seen it, this. This is completely... This is completely off topic. I'm sorry, I could have asked this real quick. Um, Pico, what's your favorite song in uh, BLC? My favorite song, it might be either Operator by Girl or mm -hmm. um, I Wanna by Too Mellow. Yeah, both. Yeah, they're, they're, both, they're both on my playlist. Uh, I, um, sure. On, on, play, on my playlist, I added, um, I added uh, Spectres by Resso, uh, Light Switch by Sky Blue. Chuck oh, up by switches. Resto. Yeah, light switches. Uh, really cool, con yeah. condensed, condensed milk. Um, yeah. yeah, yeah. I love that I song. I thought that was wanna... yummy at first. Mm -hmm. That's a hard ass yeah. title. Condensed milk. Yeah, it's yeah. it's it's a banger. I heard that shit. Like all the to be honest, hideout mixtape is the best mixtape. 
the mix. Yeah, yeah, I thought that like I thought Ocean World like got in Bomb Rush Cyberpunk. I was like, oh shit, let's go. We really in this bitch. That was, <laughs> I was like my first thought when I heard that song. When, whenever you spawn back in the hideout and light switch starts playing, I'm just like, yeah. Like, oh, that's... the bass in that <laughs> song is so good. Yeah. I can't wait for the bomb rush cyberfunk memes. They about to be gas. Yeah, they are. Oh, there's already, there's already, there's already a meme. There's already been memes going around. Of, yeah, um, everyone, everyone's Trice, been laughing at my Trice. death yell. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Yeah, I've, I've, um, already, I've already made a few as I was playing. <laughs> the trust, the the the, the there's a meme of where Trice calls someone a degenerate. Um, really? And, that that's become a meme. Hang on, I'm gonna I'm gonna find out. I'm gonna oh, send it. Oh wow, this is really bothering me. Why Discord? Okay, for some reason, the the call squares aren't even right. Um, I'm gonna uh, there's a GIF as well of someone twerking. Um, and it says me when uh condensed milk comes on. <laughs> well, yeah, you're right. They're, they're not aligned. That's bothering. Why would you tell the, us the, that? The one on the, the on the left, it uh, the, that intersection is fine. This one is fucked up for some reason. Dude, yeah, now you're. Now I'm, I'm bothered now. Like, R.A.P. No, bro. Right. Like, yeah. That's the kind yeah. of stuff, bro. <laughs> bro had to share his OCD with us. That's okay. I don't I'm sorry, man. Listen. Dude, like, I've been telling, like, my, my community that, like, if they, ever want, if they want me to, like, voice, like, any, like, meme or anything, like, I got them. Mm. Yeah, not you, West. It, it's not the yeah. screen share because the screen share intersection looks okay, good. So that <laughs> intersection is. Uh, if, is Wait, if what you, happened? If you if you if you voiced that meme and turned it into like a little TikTok or something, like that would go hard. That's that's the type that yeah, that's the type of shit you see on real. My bad. I'm I'm back now. What? Dude, no, because I love when uh VA is like 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 go out their way to like do memes mm. and stuff like that. Yeah, the, um, me, me and me and Tom, uh, me and Tom, who's another mod in the server, we've been playing through the Resident Evil games recently, and um, we found out that the voice actor of uh, Wesker, um, like voices memes if you like message him. Cameo. Um, yeah. Oh, nice. <laughs> That's fire. Not, not Lance That's like Reddit. hilarious. Yeah. I think Cameo is one of the like dopest like things because it, it's just like crazy. made a lot of people realize they can still capitalize off their talent and stuff yeah, yeah. one of my friends like her, helped start that app actually it was kind of crazy really yeah, yeah. Awesome. i used to um, be subscribed you... to joey diaz's cameo that shit was so fun, <laughs> <That's> <laughs> funny we, um, we, we, oh, we, we got the voice actor we, we got the actor of hank from breaking bad to do one for my friend's birthday um, I got um Bam Margera to do one for Nick's birthday a couple years ago. That one was fun. It was like eighty bucks. I was like, "Yo, this is totally worth it." Yeah, some of them are fucking crazy, crazy. Yeah, some of them are really expensive. Yeah, some people make Wait, you pay like a whole like contract. It, 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 yeah. it was five hundred dollars for to get one from Hank. I ended up having Sheesh. to message. We ended up getting about. Yeah, I, I literally messaged pretty much every single person I knew who was friends with. The guy that we want you're like yo 20 time. bucks yeah so we ended up making <laughs> give me 20 dollars so yeah we ended up making group chat with about 18 people um to all like pitch in um to get the, the cameo i had respect to make that work everybody paid for um, a word <laughs> yeah. but um but we got him to like uh basically just trash talk his csgo skills using hank quotes um <laughs> so that was that was pretty funny so yeah, that's are yes. we still doing this? Are still are we still doing this tier list? What's up? I it's mean, already I know, guys, I know you. I know you. I know your bottle, dude. You're, it's like coming out of your throat, like dog. <laughs> let me let me, let me talk up? shit. What's up? What's up? <laughs> so, so what, what other heart. opinions you got? <laughs> I'm, I'm trying to break some hearts, but nah, that the, the runaways bottom tier. That's why nobody knows what it is. Punisher. <laughs> Punisher. I heard Punisher is really good. Solid B tier. Solid. Yeah, we can fit and be low A tier. I by, have not seen Punished before. By no means S. You feel me? There's a lot of issues with the action and stuff like that. You know, John Burt, though, he real, he real good at yelling, but, and beating dudes yeah. up. You feel me? He real good at that. If, would you reckon, so would you recommend watching Punisher? I'd, I'd, I I'd recommend it. it. I'd recommend yeah. it, yeah. Yep, <coughs> I'd recommend watching Punisher. Another solid <laughs> uh, low A high b tier daredevil yeah. season one two one two i've and heard three. i've heard that that was amazing anyone else seen it 
I was gonna say Pico. Like, what's your what's your what's your tier list? I know I've been asked and shit like that, but like, what are what are some of the ones that are like at the top for you? Oh damn! Like, not gonna lie, when it comes to Marvel, I just be like turning my brain off. Not gonna lie, I watch that shit. <laughs> but um, I feel you. Damn. Not good. Like, it like, is one of them series where you just do that. You feel me? You can just turn your brain off, just watch that shit, and be like, ooh, flashy move, pretty colors. I like that shit. <laughs> yeah. Because yeah, yeah, usually real. I watch a lot of just like. Like, like everything else. Oh, I just realized but, um, this list doesn't have Guardians of Galaxy. Moon Knight yeah, is S tier, but I'll explain that after he's done. <laughs> Moon Knight looks good. I love Gun Gunter. You, you've been watching all the TV shows. I don't, I don't know anyone who's been watching the TV shows. Only the movies. I yeah. put them on while I blow glass, so I'll be making a bong, and then I'll have like Moon ah, Knight makes sense. some movie that I'm not that it. I haven't seen yet. That me. makes tons of sense. That makes yeah. tons and tons of sense. Yeah. What do you I guys gotta think give of that? Reasons not to leave the studio. You feel me? Also, make sure you <laughs> make sure you're paying attention to that glass and not the movie too much. You don't burn yourself. No, trust me, I got a system, bro. <laughs> I'm just fucking around. Just be stupid. <laughs> what, what? Yeah, are you, any any you guys uh, into any D, any like the DC movies like Batman, any Superman? Something. This is the DC tier. This is the DC tier. <laughs> <This is the, laughs> <laughs> Look at all that's this. hilarious Crap. um i i think i'm gonna i'm gonna actually hop off of this for a second and i think i'm gonna play mm -hmm. some brc actually on stream for a little bit oh yeah <laughs> yeah oh, i'm really? like we're, we're gonna fix the move to i love my plug oh wait wait don't, oh are, true are you, no 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 wait you're, you're gonna do i love my plug yeah, yeah. Okay, word. Um, Pico, I kind of want to like familiarize you with like kind of like what we be having going on in here because I know you just kind of like hopped into the stream and shit like that today. But um, yeah. this is like our essentially like our our Discord community like radio that um, Zeke and Rick run, and we have like this you know like a plug section where you get to like plug your music and shit like that, and like a, and a creative observatory section that we've been building out. And we do like this, this radio show essentially is like a way to showcase a bunch of different shit in the community that people are fucking we with. We also gonna that. be announcing a sample challenge. Yeah, and they do sample challenges in here and shit like that as well too. So it's pretty fire. Um, but like I, I feel like it'd be really dope to like show some of your shit off as well too. Like since we, you know, you just kind of like we since you like just tapped in and shit like that. So get folks like a little bit oh, familiar sure. with like what sure. you got going on and shit. You know. Oh shit, do the bad. If that's yeah. cool with you, I don't yeah, want to like put you on the spot or anything definitely. like that. You know what I'm saying? Little day. No, 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 dude. I love like sharing shit. Like it's hard, bro. Yeah. Like, yeah. So I mean, to, I'm like, yeah. If you guys are gonna like swing into, I don't want to like immediately like make y'all jump into like what like a mess the schedule up or nothing like that that you guys had going no, on. No, 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 Okay, but do you want me to like put it in like the neighborhood radio? So um, have, yeah, go ahead. You guys, um, let me explain let me link it. So yeah, we so have it. an actual plug okay. forum, and so there you make a post. You it you, you add a link, and then you just put a little title for what it is, and then every every week we go through whatever people put in for that week, and then we we put them on, then we record it, and then we archive that. In, uh, in another section in the server so people can listen to it later and yeah. uh it's something we, we we've done like that like pr this was pretty much the like foundation of what this radio was even for yeah okay but does that have to be like, like a link to like soundcloud or, or can it be like a file oh anything um, any, anything uh, uh if it's a file i i pro it, I don't know. I actually want to say not a file because sometimes it lets me play them on the screen share, but other times it just sends to a file. So like a SoundCloud upload would probably be the easiest. Yeah, I was gonna say you could totally yeah. share your screen. I don't give a fuck if you want, if you want to do that and just like oh, yeah. share whatever. Yeah. You want oh to yeah. Or, or 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 a screen share. Yeah. Whatever is yeah, easiest. Bet. Whatever works best for you. Yeah. yeah, I'll do that. Okay, give me a second. Let's switch I think I'll use some. Uh, use DLC. Oh. Yeah, I don't have much to say about like superhero movies and stuff. But hmm. recently, I want to hear y'all's thoughts on this real quick. Um, yeah. The like for me, like it's hard for me to like remember 
like Marvel movies and like what happens in them and stuff. The only time, the only thing that like really stuck with me was the one Spider-Man movie where like his Spidey sense like goes off, but they put you in it and you're like with Tom Holland and trying to like figure out like what the fuck is going on. And he's like, yo, like what the hell? I was you talking like, about uh, Far From Home? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That scene. Yeah, I, I, is I, that, I was. Is that, is, that, is, is that when he's on the bus? No, 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 no. It, it, was, it was when he was like, he was like on the bridge uh, thing, right? Building. No, no, no. He, he was like, wait, which? Every which oh, for the like, actual mystery, like when he was like, like in the hallucination. No, it was one with um with the, uh, I don't know was a spoiler or not. The one with like all the the other Spider Mans so, uh, with Andrew Garfield and like. Oh yeah oh, yeah. You know? Far from her. Yeah yeah yeah. The the one where like he's just standing. And then I think it did a dolly zoom and stuff, and like the, the, everything got like muffled, and like you just see Tom, and you're like, wait, what the hell's going on? And it kind of put you. Their in. spider senses hit each other when they're standing up there. Was that what you're talking about? And they all get confused. No, no, no. It's the one where like, 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 like. I don't know Someone said the scene like, with the Green oh, Goblin in the goblin. condo. Yes. Oh, yeah. okay. Oh, yeah, yeah. Oh, he's oh, walking down. Yeah, yeah. yeah and it's yeah, like yeah, it's yeah, almost yeah, like. Yeah. Uh, yeah, and it like as he walks, like the camera's like fixed on him. Yeah, yeah I completely that's drawing a blank on this. That's the first time in a honestly. long time. That's the first time in a long time that I was like, yo, like they did yeah. something. Great, I, that was the great, great scene. Willem Dafoe. Yeah, yeah. Like, that, that whole was, scene. Uh, I think that entire sequence uh, of that in that building when they were like meet and they were all like cooped up there was really. Good. If you yeah, want me to, was, I'm yeah. gonna bad. go ahead. No, no, no. Go ahead. Go ahead. I was about to say, if you want me to like give you some background for <laughs> like what that's referencing. So, Tom Holland, Spider-Man, in the comic, like, which this is pulling from, when he meets the original Spider-Man as Green Goblin, he, he sees, basically, the original Spider-Man's memories, right? That's why he feels animosity that the original... Yeah, that's, that scene is hard as fuck, Ock. Like, yeah. You know what I'm saying? So, that's why that, that scene right there almost looked like there was, like, a plane shift or something going. You know, that was the only real Whoa. way to, like, make that convey, convey, that, convey that. You know, because yeah. it was, like, a three... It's, like, a three-page uh, bit that they give to that little, like, that little timeline interference. You feel me? And that's they cool. touch on yeah. it. They that's touch on cool. it a like, little it's bit. It's, like, hereditary multiversal. Yeah, and they yeah. touch on it a little bit in the Amazing Spider-Man from the 2000s with the like the the web of fate and all that shit, and then they touch on it more in the new Enter the Spider-Verse with Miles. So Yo. that that shit all plays into each other. Yo, oh, yeah. interesting. That's awesome. Had no idea. Damn, that's, that is that's awesome. Spider-Man's so cool, man. Yeah, yeah I legit had so no idea. Better. I've yeah, been I reading comics since I was fucking out. like seven years old. Yeah, dude, if y'all don't, if y'all don't got time for comics, comics explains the goat. Yeah, yeah. I love that guy. That guy's channel is amazing. His summaries are really good. Good, good, good plug right there. I love those types of pages. Yeah, let me, let me, let me pull some stuff. Yeah, but yeah, they were definitely trying to convey something through that scene. I think that might be why that one stuck yeah. with you a little bit more than a the generic sort of like end game. Yeah type shit you know yeah that's cool okay, plus the cinematography in that movie was above average for a marvel movie you know oh yeah you could tell they, really, they didn't want to really drop well. the ball with the visuals exactly really well so. yeah. whereas like so. with black widow it was sort of subpar i don't know if many people here saw that like just yeah. the cinematography it just seems like they weren't really trying I've seen a lot of shocking scenes from Black Widow though, so it's not surprising. Uh, yeah. Like just clips, little clips on like Instagram reels and stuff that I've seen from Black Widow, so bad. <laughs> like mm -hmm. the visuals. I haven't yeah, seen Hellstrom. So, like for, like, like my main thing is that like I draw and stuff, but yeah. Um, late last year, I started making music like November. Oh, fuck into, yeah. like FL. Hell yeah, bro. So, like, for like the first like like from like November to like December and then like I think a bit after, um, I was just like making full songs and then like closing the thing. Cause the thing with FL is like with the trial. Yeah, really you can't you you can only export the MP3. You can't save the project file. And to me, 
That's so well. You you can save it. You just can't go back into it. And that's that was sick to me. Like I thought that was cool, cause it's just me sitting there for like a whole day, figuring shit out, and then like trying to make a song, and then like you know, or like like whatever, and then like that's it, and then I move on to like the next thing. So yeah, for like those fine, months, I was making like a shit ton of stuff. Like it was so like I went any so any fun. vocals or just beats. Um, I have done like. A bit of rapping and then i can put that in too but for the most part i just been like everywhere with like the genres because i listen to everything mm -hmm. so i just made like everything that i like or like at least try to so yep. let me see i don't know damn i don't know what i should put first what's the music that you listen to damn like, i don't know like name shit. like um uh, just off the top of your head something that comes to mind Tricot is like one of my favorite bands. They do math. Tricot, W W W W. Yeah, yeah. So um, fucking good. I am out of the loop. What is it? Uh, they're like a Japanese um, math, math rock, rock band. band. Yeah. Oh, okay. I sort of fell off. In the <coughs> that sounds the fire. Psy huh? rock, the Psy Z rock, math Z rock. Z definitely hit Japan. me as a math rock dude. I'm actually mm -hmm. I don't listen to that much math rock, but Tricot are really good. Oh, okay. oh, yeah. Oh, say, I'm, I'm in the same boat. I'm in the same boat. I'm yeah. more like, into like the fusion revival that happened re recently in Japan and like a lot of the vaporwave shit. All that shit's really cool to me. And then they started blending it. So it's like vapor jazz almost. Yeah. No, for sure. What were you saying? I cut cool. you off. Um, some other shit. I've been listening to a lot of uh, live or live.e. I don't know if y'all know that. Oh, one. yeah. She's so yeah, fire. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. My favorite oh, song from her is um About Love at 21. That shit is fire. Yes. Like, My like sister actually got... put me on to her. Yeah. So, like, the recent album, Girl in the Half Pearl, like, I got their vinyl. And, like, what they did with, like, the packaging and, and like, the sleeve and stuff is so sick. Um, I, I recommend them. I've been listening to a lot of uh, AJ Redico. I don't know if y'all have listened to them. But... It's a bit hard for me to like, like full albums like front to back, but like with their album, like I, like I love everything about it, and like they're just super dope uh, in general. Oh yeah. Yeah, I'll link their thing, but um, yeah, just like a shit ton of stuff. Like on on Spotify, like I usually just like make playlists and like post them and stuff. I just curate shit mm. for fun to like share. Cause like since I listen to like, like a lot of stuff, I like to share like those genres with people. But yeah, yeah. like 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 Dom, literally like one of the few, uh, one of the like last times I talked to to like Dion, um, we just talked about like Mongolian like throat singing and stuff. I was like, wait, you listen to that shit too? Like, yeah, yeah. Dion you know, has I, such it, a dope eclectic taste. I can't yeah, believe you're it's. Still you know, in. I got so He's I super tapped in. I fuck with him so heavy. Up. Yeah, put you I can't believe that cool. Metro sampled Mongolian throat singing for a future song to this day. It blows my mind. You remember this that shit? I put you on to the other oh, day, the Dom. Yeah, I remember you were showing me. Uh, yeah. yeah, I'm about to send the, that to Pico. The first mm. song, the first song on Future's Monster Mixtape samples Mongolian throat singing. Oh, oh, for real? Uh, yeah, I'm pretty, I'm pretty confident that it does. It's crazy. <laughs> yeah, but um, uh, radical. Okay. Yeah, but yeah. also been, been listening to my my boy Contenti a lot, cause they they go crazy. They recently made a a bomb rush inspired track, and bro, like oh, I can't okay. wait until he releases that shit. Oh yeah, wait. I can't wait to hear it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I'll, I'll I'll put one of his uh, what was albums in there? Control. One. For sure. He's working on Control Three right now. But yeah, like 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 a ton of stuff, a ton of stuff. Um. I sent you that video game. Oh, okay. Let's see this. He said you like Mongolian throat singing, and this is like that, but times three. I yeah. saw a Mongolian throat. I saw a Mo Mongolian throat singing like death metal band, like kind of recently as well. That's pretty cool. There's a lot you can do with that, bro. Just the versatility <sighs> okay. of Ooh, that, dope, throat that's... singing in general. Because mm. you yeah, have. So like... Indians, like Native Americans that do it, Indians, mm. Nepalese, yeah. Tibetan, well, Nepal is in Tibet, but then you have even Filipino, like, 
Buddhist monks have their own version of throat singing. I think that Ooh. there's something about that, like the Om. You feel me? There's something to that. Yeah. You know. Wait, wait, Guns. Have you listened to like like uh, Filipino folk music? Yeah. Oh, that shit. That shit. That shit fire, guys. I I I, I, uh, I listened to a lot of that because I went to Myanmar back before the Civil War really kicked off. This was back when I was in college. I I've um, been listening down there to, to a lot of. Stuff. Been listening to a lot of Mali and folk folk music lately. Oh hell yeah! Uh, because uh, there was a guy that a few years ago um, that came to Tasmania in 2017 called Basaku Kyote, um, and he plays. Uh, he's one of the only people in the world that can play this like specific Malian instrument. And he yeah came to um, my town, um, and since then I've been like really exploring like all that kind of shit. Um, hell yeah! Really, oh, yeah. really cool. Yo, have y'all heard of um, Takeshi Katamatsu? That sounds or Tsushiki. Familiar. Sorry, Tsushiki Katamatsu. I went to um, this record store in New York this weekend, and um, the guy who owned the record oh, shop yeah. started playing this like on vinyl. Yo, this shit is so gas. Didn't he have it? What's the song? What's the album called? Summertime something? It has a palm tree on the front of that shit. I know exactly what the fuck you're talking about. Is, is, it, is, it, is, it, is it this one? Is this what you're talking about, though? Hold on. Oh, Summertime Romance. Yeah, I, yeah, 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 yeah. That's exactly what I'm talking about. It, it, it's, it has, like, a palm tree on the front. It's, like, a white and red label. Oh, dude. Okay. There's one. My homeboy got album. that record. This yeah. album, Dom. This album is fire. If if you like his stuff, this is one of my favorite. That is one of my, one of my favorite songs. For sure, yeah. After After Five Clash is also fire as fuck too. Those were the two records that he played at the shop. That he was like, he just put me on a different artist, and I was like, yo, this is crazy. Yeah, yeah. I just found it. That's exactly what. I, yep, that's it. Cause that shit is um, that motherfucker is fire. So Pico, did you want to share the one of the songs that you you've made? Oh yeah, dude. I, dude, I got yo, y'all are tapped on. I got carried away, bro. <laughs> That's all good. Actually. All right. All good. It's that all good, bro. I thought that might have been the case. It's time yeah. for I Love My Plug with Neighborhood Radio. I need like Vine Boom sound effects for this or some shit like that. Yeah. I, I oh, swear yeah. to God, you can't, one, you, you, you can't one soundboard, soundboard is in, one song. soundboard is in stage, so we're gonna have sound bites. <laughs> yeah. yeah, I'll add a. I'm gonna add this. I'll add a soundboard in here shortly. Cause I'm pretty sure that you have to like add extra sounds in this shit, right? Yeah, you actually put like uh, yeah, it's like five second MP3 clips. Where where is that oh, sound? I can't, I can't that? share. I can't share my my screen on. You, yeah, might, have to, drop, uh, you drop might have to. You might have to unshare it. Yeah. It might just be. It might be one at a time for stage. I'm not oh. sure. I, I can just put it on. I can just put it on if you get the link. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Whatever y'all want to do. Um, Rick, you should play that bottom track while we wait for... Uh... <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I've got like a decent little set list over here already. Just for like starting today. Just for fun. You know what I'm saying? So, feeling pretty good about that. My, I'm gonna add like four or five more Anyone songs. Anyone keen now to neighborhood radio? Anyone keen for June part two? I'm so, so fucking excited for that. Do, do I drop this in uh, midnight radio or? Just drop it, drop, drop it wherever, just wherever. And link, like, yeah. Uh, Rick will just grab. Yeah, we can just put it. You can just put it inside the VC okay. for this. Yep. There we go. All right. right. This is one African by Yapiko. Neighborhood Radio. Ah. Wait, hold up. Wrong audio source. One sec. No worries. This is cool. <laughs> Like a check, don't be a little bit of 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 a little
Oh, this Ari really fucking. Dog, this is gas. This is super gas. Oh. Mm. Okay. This is giving me Need for Speed Underground vibes. Okay. This is gas. Uh huh. This uh-huh. is like Midnight Club vibes too. Midnight Club like two. Driving through the pa- the catacombs in Paris. <laughs> That's really really sick. This is hard. Yeah, Pico, you're cooking. Philly Raven and abandoned bank type beat facts. This would have been dope in Bombers for sure. Damn, I'm inspired. I gotta work on this house set a little bit more. What's cracking, Blue Garcon? How you doing? That was hard. Fucking... That was fucking yeah. crazy. Wow, wow, wow. good shit. Yeah, you know, I've, I've I've been saying. So I was so chatting so. with my friend Tom yesterday because when we we're running up Bomb Rush, um, mm-hmm. we we're talking about how cool it would be if they added a little DLC pack that has. Like, I didn't realize like, I was muted this whole time. I'm so sorry. Oh. <laughs> I was talking on stream. I was like, yo, this is fire. Holy shit. I was also yeah. muted. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yes. Nah, you we were going sick. About, we were talking a little bit about how um we it would be cool if they added DLC that adds a few more collectibles and songs and stuff into the game. And that's yeah. like I want that song in the game. That'd be so fire. Oh, yeah. um, That'd be fire like, in the game. Yeah. Um the first DLC is just duplicate these characters. Yeah. You dropped um them. oh sorry, my fault. Um but yeah, that that shit was super hard. Yeah, I would love to do some shit where it's like, it would be. I feel like it'd be really cool if like all of the voice actors that like really fuck with the game and that had characters in it, just like made challenges like for their own character. I feel like that'd be like mm. some really fun shit to play with. You know what I'm saying? Like, if you did like Trice's make, challenges oh. and I did Mesh's challenges and shit like that. Yeah, you get a song. Oh, that would be sick. Yeah, that could be some cool shit. It is, there's so much, there's so many. I'm sure that they're going to continue exploring that universe and having a lot of fun with it because it's, they, I feel like this is like, I, I don't know. I, I can't find any other games that have gotten this like positive a reception to release it on like I'm, this year. Yeah. I'm just annoyed that there's going to be no multiplayer because the score battles, like the crew battles, are perfect, perfect for that. I think that um, it's just like the, like getting like, they probably didn't want like hacking and shit like that so like they don't yeah, like true, I, true. they probably need to like get it ironed out first before they introduce that but i'm sure that it could in- get introduced in the future it just wasn't on i know that the core game is like single player because i was talking with um yeah. dion about that for a while and he was like we were thinking about doing local um for a while and i was like that would have been sick as fuck but i think that it was just especially, still especially on the on the switch that would have been like the perfect console to- Man, mm. okay. i just want to put this perspective out there Making a local multiplayer game 
is actually super fucking laborious. Not only just because yeah, it is. of the fact if you're doing it on the same screen. Yeah, you got to make the game twice pretty much. You got to make the game twice, basically. Yep. And then if you're doing it on two different machines, right, yep. with two people on each machine, then you have to still render it twice, but at basically like the same resolution cut in half. Yep. You feel me? At different camera angles on different characters. So they have to figure out how to rig those virtual cameras and make it so you can control those characters before we can have single player. And you have to realize that this is a small team. Super you know small team. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is a, this, this is a, this is a miniature, t- miniature team even putting out triple A class work. Facts. Right? Facts. Triple I think that a yeah. class work. Blow every that. other single player game that's out right now that's corporate bullshit. Alright, and this is from an unbiased point of view. I haven't even played the game. I just watched my homeboys play. I watched my roommate play it upstairs. I got my hands on it for a couple seconds and fell in love for the simple fact I ain't paying no microtransactions. The shit's fun right off the bat. Yep. And there's going to be dedicated support from it because I'm involved in the community. I know who's making the game. And you, these people aren't exclusive. You can, you can get in touch with them and ask them questions and give them pointers and give them critiques and we'll actually listen. You feel me? So there's a lot going mm-hmm. for this game that needs to be ironed out first before any sort of local or online multiplayer is put together. What could be implemented very soon is some sort of leaderboard. I can see yeah, that. Leaderboards would be gas. I can see that coming I'm down for leaderboards. Soon. Yeah, like Because a, like what a, like, you would do, right? Because like you know how the, and, you know, yeah, type shit. Because what I you would do. I can see them do, doing ghost races. Yeah, you can do ghost races, you can do the leaderboard, but all of that data, the point data and all that shit, that gets stored somewhere within those files. So all they need to figure out is how to get that data from those files and send back to their server so that they can make it appear in your game. Yeah, like imagine being able to create a combo line and like submit it, like upload it to like a server. And oh, that'd be really cool. Like- but I think the more people that support this game, that's what they friends, need. Yeah, get it involved, yeah. get involved in the community, and say, "Yo, this is a good ass game. I want to play this shit with my friends even when they're not here." That will give the devs the incentive and the drive to make that shit a reality. But right now, just having the game as polished as possible without breaking that shit—that's the main goal. Yeah, absolutely. Because it's a good fucking prop. Facts. Absolutely. All right. Um, Rick, what, what song do we have up next? Uh, next up, I'm going the, to I love my plug. I'm gonna hop out, but you guys continue. I love my yep. plug. Um, uh, I'm gonna annoying. work on this set a little bit more and then play some more BRC because I'm inspired. Hell yeah! Awesome. All right, I'm gonna fuck you, with y'all. Thank you for joining. Yeah. Of course, thank y'all for having me. Nice.